A daredevil Melbourne dad has conquered high seas and circling sharks to become the first person to cross Bass Strait on a wing foil. The sport's popularity spiked in lockdown with thrill seekers comparing it to flying on top of the ocean. Man, what a day. Absolutely epic. What? He's been called crazy many times. Father of two, Andrew English, clinging on for dear life to this. An inflatable sail and a hydrofoil board. The first person to wing foil across treacherous Bass Strait. I was circled by fins. There was times where I thought I was going to be eaten by a shark. The 55-year-old beginning his 240-kilometre journey off the northeastern tip of Tasmania. Woo! Which way do I, Victoria? Andrew's passion for wing foiling starting as a lockdown hobby to help combat depression. This expedition called Gone with the Wing, raising funds to help others. Just gliding across the ocean with the flying fish, with the dolphins. Reaching speeds of 30 kilometres an hour. Seas are three metres, they're four, you know, 10 metre rolling swells, they're mountains. Where I can't really see the support boat, they can't see me a lot of the time. The adrenaline junkie battered and at times becalmed, but spurred on by his family. So I'm completely terrified. This is just something he really needs to do. Uh, so yeah, I'm crossing my fingers and hoping for the best. After four days, land ahoy. He made it all the way to Wilson's Promontory. Without doubt, one of the best things I've ever done. Andrew wanting to prove to his children you're never too old to take the plunge. He's already planning his next wild adventure. Next time we try the Tasman, head over to New Zealand. <laughs> we wish him well. Jackie Quist, 7 News.